Morandi is a well-known artist. The visual approach of Morandi uh, was very important for him. But the 30s is uh, perhaps the less known period. This period was uh, really uh, important for him because it is the time when he found his own way, very original, very unique, uh, to approach the paintings. And also he was able uh, to see deeply the poetry he can do and the meaning he can uh, take from the paintings. We want to also to have in the exhibition not only paintings but also etchings. Morandi was an incredible worker with this media. He studied by himself, he never had a teacher. The etchings in the 30s take the most part of his time because they are very long to realize. And we have here three examples of three different ways. One more uh, black, one very complex and one more uh, synthetic. And we put together the work with uh, Wolf and Lai, with the paintings of Morandi, the ambiguity of the color that come from the walks and come also from the paintings. And I think it is something that is very, very powerful. We look to the past always from where we are, I used to tell, and looking at Lai, we can understand perhaps better the poetry of the paintings of Morandi. The last room we put a few works and they are some iconic works that we can see in relation with the paintings they are in front. They are the last painting he did in 63, the last year when he was working. This is a strange name to call uh, this object a sculpture because uh, uh, Morandi never was really a sculpture but when he was unable to find an object that has the proportion he needs in his painting he built for himself. This object that don't has a bottom and don't has any possible use because if you, you cannot put nothing inside, no liquid first at all and also don't has a back and uh, is only the front is an object for the painting. The Centre for Italian Modern Art is not a museum, it is not a gallery, it is a centre of studies and I hope the people can stay quickly in front of the work to have a personal direct relation with the works as in a tomb. And uh, I hope that uh, the direct relation with the paintings can give to the people a uh, most uh, fresh idea about uh, what is art and Italian art. Mm -hmm.